Well, you may have already seen this heroic couple last week on the Jennifer Hudson Show. Al and Vivian Robinson, both pastors at the Spirit of Truth Urban Ministry, have made headlines for their heroic actions that ensured the safety of more than 150 lives during the Buffalo blizzard. Learning more about their amazing story, we are joined by Kimberly LaRussa from Sweet Buffalo and our local heroes here. Kimberly, thank you so much for bringing these guys on. This is an incredible story. How did you hear about it? Well, um, they have a member at their church, Lachey, who messaged me their story, and I was just like, oh my goodness, like you can't even believe it. She sent me um, several stories of the people that they helped, and I couldn't even keep up with it. It was just, it's like yeah. a movie. Yeah. So, Al, uh, explain what happened Friday when that snow started coming down, and, and what did you realize? When did you realize we're going to need to help here? Well, I realized it after my wife's uh, tweet. Uh, her message went out 1,700 times, uh, and it was a real event where people needed to get indoors. And my wife looked at me and she says, "Listen, honey, we're going to have to open up the church." I said, "Well, let's open those doors." Wow. And from that point on, it went, and then it turned into a rescue and extraction operation. Um, you opened the church. The church kept the heat yes. on the whole time so it was and warm in there divine yes. intervention yes. oh my goodness <laughs> and Vivian you said you had already stocked up on food yes. for actually the whole year yes because I was not going out and not snow so you had enough food to feed 150 people that came into your church for days how long were people there what were some of their stories um, they were there for the last couple the last person left on the sixth day oh my goodness so it was like a scheduling so it's like breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks, constantly every day. So the first couple that came in, she was pregnant and she was like afraid that she was going to not see her children again. And then another family came in and she had frost on her ankle and it was like, it, it was bubbling. It's like third degree burns. Ooh. And then after that, and then another man came in and his beard was frozen to his face. The snow was stuck to his body. Oh and then another family came in. He he's like had oxygen and it was like he only had 30 minutes, minutes to, of oxygen left on his to tank. live. And then after that, the senior people coming in. I mean, we were just getting people left and right and just grateful and thankful because they thought they were going to die. And I had to embrace them. I had to hold them. I had to um, make them feel that you're going to live today. And they cried. I cried. And I found blankets, warmers, everything to make sure these people were comfortable and felt like they were at home. Yeah. And the tears, the tears it was just kept flowing. True heroes in this community. Oh, my goodness, you saved so many lives. Um, Kimberly, they were honored on the Jennifer Hudson show. And what did we see them get honored with? It was it was amazing. Yeah, so Jennifer Hudson gave them a surprise that they were not expecting. <laughs> <laughs> and you are very excited about that? Tell yes. us. Absolutely. It looks like we got a six night, seven day stay at St. <laughs> Lucia. <laughs> all paid for from the flight from Buffalo to the flight back home. That is so, so cool. Yeah, God has been good to us. Yes. Wow. Yeah, super well, excited. I heard her say you guys are probably cold yes. and you're ready for a trip <laughs> yeah, somewhere that's warm. Right. Yes. So that'll be nice. And you don't know when that trip will happen not, quite not yet. yet. Not yet. We have uh, some concerns at the church that uh, happened as a result yeah. of the, the blizzard that we want to address before okay. we go out and do things. Yes. And Al, you said, you mentioned that you'd ended up doing some extractions. Yes. I heard you carried a woman two yes. and a half blocks in uh -huh. that storm. I did. Tell uh, me quickly about that. Well, she had messaged me on Messenger and said, listen, I, there's no way I can help. Then she called me on Messenger and I answered the phone and uh, she told me that uh, I can't make it to the church. I said, well, why not? I mean, it's, we're just two and a half blocks away. She says, I'm a cancer survivor and I can't use my legs. And I looked at my wife, my wife looked at us, and we saw this horrible stuff for people in the snow and that, and uh, you know, we got really teary-eyed, but she knew I had no choice but to go. And so I, I, I left, and, and pulling your legs out of three feet of snow for that distance, it took me almost 45 minutes to walk two and a half blocks, but the lady's life was saved. She was brought to the church, oh, and, she, yeah, and she made it. So we were really excited, oh, my really excited for that. And has anyone come up to you, Leslie, 
afterward, you know, we're a, a, a month past from this almost. Has anyone come up to you to thank you? Absolutely. Oh, yes, we still have relationships. Yes. I go down the That's street to visit. They call, they FaceTime. Good. We have built a family relationship, so we built more Beautiful. family. So it's it, it was the best Christmas ever Aww. that I've ever seen, the best Christmas miracle. We woke up with 154 people at our church all celebrating the gift of life. Wow. It's beautiful. Yeah, guys, thank you so much for God what you bless did. you for having us, yeah. Kimberly. Thank, thank you, so you for bringing them on. So this was so thank inspirational. Oh, it's it's an honor to be with the both of you. And uh, they have a member of their church actually created a fundraiser um, for the roof of their church. Um, it's leaking, and so a GoFundMe was created by a member of their church. So we definitely want to promote that on Sweet Buffalo as well. Thank okay, you. we'll make sure thank to get you. that on our website as thank well. You. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Thank you for thank coming. Thank you so much. We will, oh, there's video of that roof leaking there uh, uh, of your church. So we'll make sure to get that GoFundMe posted on our website, wivb.com, to help you guys out if that's what people want to give to. Thank you. We want to help more people. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Absolutely. What is the name of the church one more time? S Spirit of Truth Urban, Urban Ministry. ministry. Urban, Urban, Urban Ministry. Urban in love joy. <laughs> love joy. We are in love joy. Okay. <laughs> okay. Very good. Full of love and joy. That's right. Yes. Well, coming up, California trying to clean up while bracing for...